What's up, YouTube? So I've been working on my left right. Why is that? Really hammering in that footwork so I can bring left right back, baby. Let's go. I just gotta work and you know I'm doing that. Never stop, never stop, always on attack. Locked in the path, never getting off track. Whatever I lack, add it to my bag. And I got plenty more where that came from. And my price is right, I never change, bro. I don't get it done, get it done, right? And that's every day, that's young life. Today I want to talk to you about why I'm switching to left right, how I'm going to do that, and why I switched to right left from left right in the beginning. I have videos on that already, so if you've already seen it, you already heard the story, but I'm going to get into story time. But first, real quick, I'm Steven. Welcome to the channel. If you're new, hit that subscribe. Help me grow. Help me reach more people. Help me get more dunkers in the world. Super cool. Uh, I have a podcast that I do almost every single week. I was doing it daily, but I'm a little bit more to the weekly, get more interviews. I kind of finished it off with the Dunk Life Laws, which I'm writing a book about. So really challenging challenging myself. I love creating content in every platform. Search my name everywhere. You'll find it. I love TikTok. So there's a chance I slept too much and I just have too much energy. So I got to let some out real quick. Yo, what is good? Welcome to TikTok Trivia, your new favorite show where I call my friends, ask them crazy questions, and they don't even know they're on the show. <laughs> First episode, we're doing my boy Chi. Hopefully he answers. Chi, what's up, dude? Hey, we're, do <laughs> we're doing TikTok trivia. I'm gonna ask you three questions, you ready? I'm ready. All right, uh, how many bones are in our body? 128. 206. <laughs> All right, what was Ethiopia called before it was called Ethiopia? Uh, <laughs> close, Abyssinia. Oh, very close, okay. <laughs> what is Lady Gaga's original name? Jessica. <laughs> No, Stephanie, Joanne, Angelica, Jeremy, Yanada. <laughs> See ya! And that's how we play. By, by the way, my podcast, the algorithms got a lot better. So any dunk training you want, search my name and add it to it. Steven Selly diet, Steven Selly strength, speed, footwork, technique, left, right, right, left, you can find it. So I have more in-depth podcasts on this exact topic and I'll tell you where I'm at right now with it. But I just wanted to let you guys know. So subscribe, help me out, it's really fun. I love doing this either way. I love bringing that high quality love as I call it, where I give you good audio, good video, good quality information, make the most of your time and entertainment. So looking forward to having more conversations with some of the best dunkers in the world. And yeah, just expanding my content. It's really been fun. Thank you all for joining. And now into what I'm doing, what today's video is about. It is my injury mode. I've been had this bum hamstring. I overloaded it. I jumped too much. So if you're feeling sore, don't jump through that soreness. If you're feeling any pain, that's what I'm all about. Helping you guys get to the root of the foundation so you can have long-term progress. So I switched from left right to right left because my simply my footwork was better. It was more natural for my feet to plant the correct way. Left right was a little bit more aggressive off the dribble. Like I felt better attacking the rim, but my footwork was poor and I didn't know back then, which is why when I helped you I didn't know to focus on that I was like I'm just gonna push it I, I let I it was almost like I I forgot all these different foundation things and just tried to chase my vertical which is what I want you guys not to do because then I fall and then I have to, all these bad patterns and it's I have setbacks and injuries and all these different things so I want you to avoid that now I'm switching because which I'll get to in the video and I'll show you is that when I go right left right now that really hurts my hamstring so going left right I can still work on some explosive activity and keep my sanity for one because I love jumping, but also it's a great time to work on that left right technique. And what I'm gonna be doing is really focusing on eliminating variables. So if it's zero steps where I'm literally have my left foot already planted on the ground and just moving my right foot, I started there a couple weeks ago. Now I worked up to a couple more steps and as you'll see, I'll get into it, but basically, the two reasons are I'm gonna lay off my hamstring and work on that left right technique. I'm so excited for left right because I've never worked on the technique specifically because I'm always focused on just trying to jump higher and jump more. But I wanna dunk in games, that's my ultimate goal. I always, I wanna dunk versatility. I want versatility in my dunks, meaning come from any angle, try different spins, try different game type situations and left right just feels so good off the dribble. So. That being said, hope you guys enjoy this video. Leave me a comment what you guys want to see. So excited to bring you interviews with exclusive high-level dunkers and just people in the dunk world and different authors and my book. And I'm just excited. So hopefully you guys are liking this content. And also I have a program coming out, an instant jump technique program that I worked really, really hard on. I've been working on it for the past six months almost, putting videos together to make it 
as best as I can so you guys can master your technique, the best program ever created. So stay tuned for that. And most importantly, enjoy. Go hard. Whatever day you're watching this, I hope you're watching this in the morning and you get the most out of your day. That's what I'm all about. That's what all my content is about. That's why I dunk, just to maximize my experience on this planet. So I hope you guys enjoy. Let's go. On my left, right. Why is that? My right hamstring's been bummed. It's been injured for a while. I'm really working hard on it. I'll make another video on what I've been doing to work on that. But basically, it hurts when I lengthen it which is this motion, which is my big right left penultimate, which is how I normally jump. So two things I'm doing. I'm laying off that lengthening of my hamstring and I'm working on my left right. And the reason I switch is a whole nother video. You can check my YouTube and my podcast is that I switched because my left right always planted like this. It always planted and, and I twisted. So I'm laying off my right hamstring with right left planting and I'm focusing on my left right footwork so I can bring left right back, baby, let's go. It's been a lot of fun, it's been a few weeks and the way I'm doing it is this. What I'm doing is I'm not doing my full approach because when I do full approach, something breaks down. So what I'm doing is just focusing on the last couple steps, really hammering in that footwork. And the reason I'm telling you this is because I get a lot of questions, how do I switch plants? How do I work on my footwork? This is how you do it. One step at a time, hammer that in, watch yourself, record yourself. I got a lot of energy today, as you can tell, and I'm making progress. So stick around. I'm really excited to get left, right. It feels really natural for me to go at the rim. It's not the most natural with my footwork, as you notice, because I switched to right, left, but it is natural when I attack the rim. I think because my right arm's in front, but it's a lot of fun. So I'm gonna try to get one jump here, a little warm. Yay! 10 foot rim really high up there. And as you see, I did a full approach, but it was a little slower. And the only reason I'm doing the full approach now is because the last three, four weeks, I've been doing just one to three steps, no more than that. And even that one, I felt a little bit of a twist, but it doesn't feel nearly as bad as it was. So that was a good one. I'm not gonna push it anymore, but what I am gonna do is just work on this right here. Ooh, that one felt perfect. I didn't get that high as I wanted to, maybe not as up, but my left foot, the block foot, this foot right here, when I planted, felt solid. It didn't twist, it felt solid. So that's what I'm working on, really fun. Stay tuned for the journey, boy. Let's get it. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to hit those buttons that help me do good. Really helps me out a ton and just we're gonna keep it growing, baby. I love you, toodles.